Previously on MD. Got a friend of yours down here. Wants to see you. Name is Ryder, Neil Ryder. Says his back's bothering him. Keep him around. Run an x ray or something. I'll be down in half an hour. But wherever you go, go with all of your heart. I thought of you. Man, can't you give me something to hold me over? I'm in a lot of pain. How you doing, Doc? Levi, right? At your service. 40 Vicodin. Uh, generic hydrocodone, okay? Sure. I love you. Hey, seen Thor around? He's seen a patient of mine named Ryder. Somebody plowed into the bus stop. Get the page out to all staff. We're gonna need backup. Dr. Yang called in. Quick pressure right here. Yeah. Oh, man. Full compressions. The skull's crushed. Your daughter was an incredibly beautiful person, and I understand how you'd refuse this because of your love for Gina, but you have to do it. You have to do it for that very reason, because you love her. It's, um, it's the most difficult thing. If you say yes, I promise you I will not let your daughter die in vain. I promise you, we can bring some meaning to this senseless death. Burrito guy's back if anyone needs a breakfast tip. What's shaking? Uh, rule out appy, two MPAs, possible ectopic, and ammonia. Well, what are you waiting for? You want me to take them all? Huh? Hey. Hey, hey. I heard a friend Ryder surrendered to the police this morning. Yeah, that's why I heard. I never should have written him that script. He changed the number, he admitted it. What happened wasn't your fault. That's why I keep telling myself. You keep telling yourself that. All right, people. Somebody's going to die today and tomorrow and the next day. Let's get to work. I have a 23-year-old with massive head trauma. Brain death declared this morning at 4.47. Hemodynamics are solid. Serology is all negative. Family signed the consent. About an hour ago. Liver and kidneys will be staying here at the Mish. The heart goes to Las Vegas. When's the harvest? The Las Vegas team is prepared to travel as soon as the airport reopens. They're expecting the weather to change sometime this afternoon. Once they have the heart, the other teams will follow. She'll be ready. Well, thank you for calling us. Nice to see you, Nico. You OK? Gina's gonna save four lives today. Fourteen people were treated in the ER and released last night. Twelve had to be admitted to ICU. Cole, any extra help you need? 
Mr. Donga. On behalf of the Sutro Medical Corporation, may I say how very sorry we all are about yesterday's tragedy. I appreciate that. We've arranged crisis counseling for the staff. Round the clock on psychiatrists and our multi-faith chaplaincy. Sutro would be happy to pitch in and help pay for that. Thank you, Mr. Donga. You're welcome. And the memorial services? Tomorrow uh, at noon and midnight, one for each shift. Sutra would be happy to cover the flowers. Thank you. Again. So good luck with the press conference, and, uh, you know, feel free to mention that the entire Sutro medical family stands behind the mish in their hour of darkness. You're angling for free publicity at a time like this? Oh, it's just the only way to give meaning to this terrible tragedy. How are you, Aileen? Well, I'm all right, considering. When I, uh first saw the news on TV, I was uh, so worried. I mean, it uh, could have been you out there. Chester, I... Well, thank you for your concern. I guess sometimes, you know, it just takes a tragedy like this to uh, realize. Well, there are sutro patients among the injured, and I want you to know that I plan to process their claims with speed and efficiency. So you got out of here last night. Yeah. Yeah, it was hard to sleep much. Well, we're used to dealing with other people's tragedies. This one, uh, hit too close to home. Way too close. This is me. You not getting off? No. Just riding with you. Uh, you like Korean food? Because I know a great place nearby. Maybe we can walk over there after work. I get off at five. Meet me in the lobby. Are you in trouble with the law again? You and I need to talk sometime about whether my guy Taggart is going to need a bypass. Yes. You haven't even looked at the case. Doesn't matter. Who couldn't use a bypass? I mean, Dr. Goldman, hemodialysis. Dr. Goldman, hemodialysis. How do you find the time? It's a shop. I mean, you're always wearing something new. Girl's gotta have a hobby. Valentino, expensive hobby. <laughs> I used to like to shop for my ex. Huh. Is that weird? Only if you're straight. What about lunch? What about it? to talk about your bypass case? Can I let you know later? Sure. You have two messages. Dr. Kellerman, this is Laura Connors. I was hoping to set up a time to talk. Dr. Kellerman, this is Stu Mitchell with ASC Cardiac Solutions. We spoke last week. I'm fine, in case you were worried. Hey. Our pressure dropped to 60, she's crashing. Try increasing the dopamine. No doubt, we're high in Neil. No. The harvest needs to go now. It doesn't work that way. The transplant team does the harvest. Any word from Vegas? Then? Hoping to reopen the airport by early oh, afternoon. Geez. She won't make it that long. You have to do the harvest. No. But once the heart's removed, you only have six hours or it goes to waste. It's a chance we have to take. Kidney and liver team's available. Standing by. Call Vegas. Tell them we're going ahead. Get the heart there somehow. Get her to the OR. I 
can give you a call when we're done. <clears throat> I'll stay. Do you need another? Right. My blood's Nice. Right. Got the thoracic here. Let's have that on the chest. Cautery. Sterile saw. Hold ventilation, opening the chest. Chest spreader. Cross clamping the aorta. There's the cardioplegia. Cold slush. Arrested. Can turn off the vent now. Scissors. Tell the liver team we'll be ready in a couple of minutes. Any word on the airport reopening? Still no time estimate. We can't wait. Bag, please. Autopsy one of these days, you know that? Well, they usually start down at the other end. You still got the Cessna? Yeah, it's the one thing my ex wife's accountant didn't get. It's parked at a little airstrip. Perfect. Across the hey, can you take off in the fog? Taking off is simple aerodynamics. Landing in a fog, it's a problem. It's really thick. I mean, I mean, I can't even see past the propeller right now. Okay. All right, all right, let me. Tell me, real good time to land? No way, not in this muck. Are you crazy? I'll be above it in a minute. See? All right. What's the ETA to Vegas? A little over three hours. We get there, lunch is on me. I got a buddy there on the strip bar. He's got a killer smarter sport. <laughs> Morning. Morning. Do you need something? Uh, I, I heard Mr. Lin's being moved out of ICU. Amazing. I thought that guy was history. Yeah, I did some reading. Yeah, he must have undergone massive clot lysis, possibly related to levels of protein C, antithrombin, or platelet activating factor. Protein C, platelet activating factor. Yang. Dr. Posner. Matt. Call, call me Matt. Or Skip. You know, my, my friends, you know, call me Skip. Or, or, or Matthew's good. Or just Matt. Okay. Matt, then. I'm gonna go turn this x-ray in. 